for. Welcome to me breaking down sports jerseys for major games. First off, we're doing FIFA 16 because it's the first. It was in my PS3 in the first place. So now, yeah, you won't see it. On the bottom left, but I put it on mute because I don't want to get in trouble for the music. I know how picky YouTube can be. So anyway, so I'm going to go through some leagues and give you jerseys and all that. Argentina doesn't really have much, but I'll talk about Boca Juniors. Oh, fuck, I have to do it this way. So Boca Juniors by BBVA. See their jerseys. The alternate, the whole yellow. Classic kit. And the football club catalog. Oh man, it would be nice to get retro jerseys, but I guess you have to be on the internet. Australia doesn't really have much. Austria, my boy, Red Bull. I'm gonna just check Red Bull Salzburg. There's Red Bull right there. The classic white with red for Red Bull. Black with yellow. Okay. Look at Belgium. There's one club I want to take a look at, and that's Anderlecht. So I guess I should have done this. And then Chile is, uh, I don't really know who the big boys in Chile are. Colo Colo, I think. I think it's Colo Colo. Yeah, so the jersey. So Anderlecht's jerseys. You see the B&B Paribus, like the bank. That sponsors the French Open and um, the purple and white stripes, yellow there. Colo Colo, Direct TV, so why? Alright, so Chile, Colombia's number one team is. I don't know who one of the best teams are. Atletico Nacional, I'll just take a look at that. And, oh, why did I do that? And Denmark. Well, I'm not going to do much about Denmark, but one of their best teams is, I think it's Copenhagen, is it? Mm. Yeah, Copenhagen. Alright, so Atletico Nacional, the green and white stripes, the green with the black, so they go with white shorts and then black shorts. Oh, well, classic kit. Ooh. Wow, they have classic kit too. Why don't I even unlock those? But yeah, those kind of look cute. And then Copenhagen, a Carlsberg beer, white at home, and then the blue and purple, the blue and black stripes. England. Okay, so let's look at England. But we're going to look at the Premier League teams. This will take a while, I promise you. But Arsenal against Aston Villa. Arsenal's home colors, the white Emirates. Red with the white shoulders, white pants. The road, they're showing the gold and blue. Alternate. Those stripes kind of look like a road thing. Classic kit, you know, with the arsenal, the, uh, what did they freaking call it? Trebuchet? No, that cannon. It's kind of cute. On the meantime, Aston Villa, QuickBooks for, you know, taxes. That's their thing. With the um, per blue and the blue and the purple, uh, QuickBooks yellow, black, classic kit. Oh, nice purple with the red stripes. I kind of like that. They have two classic kits. Oh, that's a different jersey with the red. Well, you see the socks. So, yeah, I think it's gonna be better if I just do it with the like this. Bournemouth. Uh, you see Mansion Poker, I think, with the red and black stripes, the road jerseys, a two-tone blue and then black at the bottom, alternate, all mauve, if you call it mauve, I shall call it mauve, Chelsea, sponsored by Yokohama Tires, who used to sponsor them, someone used to sponsor them, but this is 2016, I know, but Yokohama Tires, the classic gold blue and then the white. The alternate of black, classic kit. Ooh, that's really classic. I don't know what that thing in the center is, but I wish I could turn these guys around. 
say what's on the back, but yeah, classic kit. That's a very classic kit. Crystal Palace. Well, Mansion Poker 2 with the red and blue stripes. And then you got the white shirts with the red and blue stripe. Everton. You got yourself a Chang. I don't know what Chang is. Some beer or something? The blue and the white. And then a white shirt with black short. Alternate green. Black. Why the heck would you have green? Their classic kit is Carfina? I don't know what their classic kit is. NEC. Yeah, that's the kit. That's the NEC kit that, you know, Lineker had. So, you know, it'd be nice to see Everton in those colors, the NEC colors. Lobster City. Another team Gary Lineker played for well, some town. King Power. I think this game, yeah, this game came out. Just after Leicester actually snuck in and stayed into the Premier League. This was before their 2016 season, which they shocked everyone by winning the title. So that's the home jersey, King Power, and blue. I'm surprised they're not wearing white, but there's the black. Uh, alternate is white. Okay. Um, Liverpool. Liverpool FC is hot as hell. United Tottenham Arsenal. What's my name? Standard Charter. All red. And then the white. Alternates are black. The classic kit, I guess, with the LFC and the that bird on their shoulder. There's another. What's the difference between this one and that one? Oh, the I guess the stripes. Not really up for it. Man City. Their home jersey, sponsored by Etihad Airlines. So sky blue with the white pants because you know sky blue. They're the Man City. They're the Blues in Manchester. Black. Shirt, alternate in green. Hmm. Classic kit. Wow, that is really classic. Oh, it's got the Iron Cross, I think. Wow. That's a good classic kit. Oh, man. Red and black. They used to wear red and black. This. Manchester United. Well, my boys. Man U, my Premier League team. Sponsored by Chevrolet in this iteration. The red and the black. I mean, the white shorts. White with black shorts. Oh wait, alternate all black. Wait, what's the... Oh, I thought that was the poppy one. Hmm. The design on the shorts. Oh, wow, they didn't, they didn't give Man U a classic kit. That's unusual. Newcastle. Famous Newcastle Wanga, which actually went under, I think, a year later. Well, it was a loan service, I think. The classic black and white stripes. Got that with the blue, light blue shirt. The alternate, that pink and white. On straight down the Wanda. Classic kit. They have a classic kit. Why does the menu have a classic kit? Newcastle. Is that them current? So it goes something? A Newcastle. Hmm. That's a weird one. Anyway, uh, Norwich. The Canaries. Aviva. Um, insurance. The classic yellow and green Canaries. Surprise that their away jerseys are green and yellow. No white. Aviva. The rugby shirts, if you will, with the striping. So, feel, Norwich doesn't have a white. That's unusual. Southampton. The red and white stripes by Spieho. Their away jerseys in this version green with the black stripes. Hmm. Okay, so nothing else. Spurs. That's Tottenham. Why can't they just say Tottenham? But anyway, Tottenham. The AIA insurance thing. The stripe. The white shirt with the blue shorts. Away, nah, that's not bad. That's a decent thing. Alternate is purple. Mm. No classic for Tottenham. Stroke City, as I call it. Stroke City, the red and white stripes. Bet 365. Okay, their road jersey's black with a green stripe. Classic kit. Well, the red and white stripes, but yeah, I think that, you know, I don't know. Sunderland. So Sunderland also is red and white stripes. Data bet? Or Gaffa bet? I got green. Sunderland wearing green as road jersey? Hmm. Swansea? The Swans as they call them? From Wales? You see, their road jerseys are with the green stripes. Okay. Watford. Now remember, this is 2015-16. Watford. With the yellow and black tone, black with the road jerseys, 
that it? Nope, West Brom. So West Brom, the classic blue and white stripes. Road jersey red with black. Classic kit. Well, I guess classic in the 1940s style. Right then. Some teams have these jerseys, classic jerseys, and most of West Ham, the purple and blue. I think they're confused with Aston Villa. They almost look the same. I think they're the same. But yeah, West Ham, you know, Ethan from Basinga, that's his favorite team. Ethan Basinga from Simon, that's a team. JJ's, I think, is Arsenal. Uh, Toby is Man U, like myself. Josh is Millwall. Uh, Simon, I don't know if he has a team. Vic, I don't think he has a team. And the other one. Harry. I think Harry's Man City. I don't know. But road jerseys with the blue with the purple stripe. Alternate, all black. That's it. Is that it? Yeah. Alright, so FL. So Birmingham, Blackburn Rovers. They used to be a decent team back in the day. See their jerseys. Classic kit with, what is it? McLean's thing on it. But yeah, the blue and white. Because Blackburn were the 1995 champions. Bolton. I think we'll take a look at Bolton. Their jerseys. Okay. Um, Brantford. Brighton. Bristol. Burnley. Burnley. Yeah, that looks like a Minecraft thing with their uh, coat of arms. But no, it's not. Cardiff City. Charlton. Darby. Okay, we'll go with Darby. Darby County, just eat. The alternate, mm. classic kit. Yeah, the Darby, because Darby back in the 1970s were decent until Brian Clock came and ruined it. Fulham, they used their regular mainstays. Fulham there, yellow and black, look. Huddersfield Hall, gotta check those jerseys out. The yellow and black. Kind of like that. Orange and black, I mean. Uh, Ipswich, Leeds. They used to be good. They've just gone up to the Premier League nowadays, but Leeds. You see them? Basic jerseys. No no sponsor on the front. That's unusual. Middlesbrough, they are sometimes Premier League superstars. Ramson sponsoring their look for that year. MK Dons, Nottingham Forest. Gotta love Nottingham. They just came up to the, they're coming up to the Premier League for the 2022-23 season. Just a note, not, I have had a feeling, feel, uh, feel for Nottingham Forest because of Brian Clough being the manager that helped them win two European Cups in 79 and 80. And also because they used to be sponsored by the Bats and you know my national heritage, QPR in the second tier, QPR, Air Asia, the famous blue and white stripes. They go with that. Alternate. The checkerboard. That's for Croatia. Reading. Um, Rotherham. Sheffield Wednesday. They used to be decent. Wolves. That's Wolverhampton. Might as well see their jerseys. The orange and black. See that one? Classic kit. Saw. Huh. What a classic. I'm missing. Thirdly. Barnsley. Blackpool. Bradford. Burnbury, Chesterfield. Yeah, I think he, there's Millwall. There's Josh's team, Millwall. So Josh, um, oh my God, I'm blanking. Not the single. Josh Circa. Yep. Uh, Millwall. They won. Okay, so France. Let's go with France. Um, do the big five. Angers. Okay, Angers, Baudet. Well, they have a different thing on the on their chest, home and away. So that's kind of strange. Monaco. There's a principality of Monaco. Fedcom, you know the famous red triangle, white triangle. Alternate, just without the triangle. They the home jerseys. The red. Yeah. And then, they won in 1977, was it? The European Cup? I can't remember. But yeah, St. Antonin, St. Etienne. I know they say it differently in French, but I have an accent from Buing Gump. That's X. Y. That's Scotland's thing. 
Why would you put that there? Oh, there it is. It, I see the X where the home jerseys are. Look. Troyes. I'm doing the big five leagues. Troyes. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Yellow and black. Uh, Lorient. Okay, okay, yeah, B and B, and then their middle, the their sponsor jersey is different. Bush. Okay, that's not a bad alternate, but B and B, why was it the whole nonce? Synergy. Synergy. Ajaccio. Okay. Carfoot. There's only one key team in France. Well, here's Bordeaux, Kia, the famous V shape on their front. The V there, kind of like that, in a sense. Lille. I don't know who that sponsor is, but kind of looks kind of strange. Classic kit. Oh, they have a classic kit. Lil has a classic kit. Ugh. Yeah, football club catalog. I think that's online. So Montpellier, Montpellier, there. Sud Le Femille. I don't know. I can't pronounce. I can't look at it right. There's Nice. Not nice. It's Nice. See there. Soleil. The Trois de Soleil. Right there. The black with that. Olympique Lyon. Hyundai, sponsoring them, Leon, the whole red away jersey, classic kit. Oh, that's a good classic kit. The gray with the blue and red stripes down the center. Why is it? Renault, okay. What? Anyway, yeah, the stripes down the middle. Marseille, 93 French Open, uh, European Cup champ. Into Sports, sponsoring them. Nice blue and black. Alternate Oble, classic kit, RMC. Hmm. And then another classic kit, uh, Ericsson. Ericsson Communication. That's not what I think about when I think myself. There's the big boys. Paris. The red stripe down the center of the blue shirt. And then they just wear white. Alternate black. Classic kit. Hmm. I don't know. That would be a good classic kit. Well, that would be more of a classic kit. You know, the red dress and all that. Sebastia and their jerseys, the black and all that. That looks like a wolf. Or is that the coat of arms for them? Probably the coat of arms for Bastia. Cowan. And the Cannes Film Festival alternate. Yeah, they don't wear white. Dad the Reims, they went to the next, what was it, 1956 final? The first European Cup final, you know, between European club teams. The white. Stade Rene. San Bio. Okay. Alternate there. And Toulouse. Get loose. Toulouse. Okay, purple and white. Alternate there. And that's it. All right. Uh, Deutschland. Cologne. Well, they like they say Cologne K O L N, but Cologne we say C O L O G N E. Right there. They have a classic kit. Guess what their logo? Mainz. Okay. Not bad. Kind of a weird alternate, but okay. I like. Oh, the checkerboard for their classic kit. That's not bad. Offenheim. SAP. So that's what you got. And the yellow road jerseys. Alternate. Classic kit. Yellow and blue. Mm, yellow. Yuck. Byron Leverkusen. 
the LG lights good. Iron Leverkusen where Jürgen Klopp no, sorry, Sterman, sorry. Iron Leverkusen. Wait. Classic kit with the O four on it for Leverkusen O four. Okay, that's kind of nice. Borussia Dortmund. That's where Jurgen Klopp used to match for Liverpool. Leon B. Uh, Alright. Alternate in white. Classic kit, yellow and black. So, yeah, Dortmund. Yeah, they won the, what was it, 97 title? Or was it someone else? Anyway, yeah. Magram Black. Post Bank, you have that green stripe on the right there. Wearing mostly green. Alternate, hmm, classic kit. Okay, that looks like a classic kit. White with the black and green on it. Oh, it doesn't have the numbers on the shirt. Short. Eintracht Frankfurt. 1960, they lost to Real Madrid in the European Cup final. So, there's Eintracht. Okay, black and then white. Yellow for the alternate. Classic kit. Yeah, that looks like a classic kit. And Augsburg. Alright, Augsburg. Not bad with that jersey. Alternate. Classic kit. Yeah, the green and red stripes for Augsburg and the Augsburg thing. I see Byron. I don't know why they didn't say Bayern Munich. T Mobile, the famous red shirts and all that. Not bad. The road jerseys look nice. Alternate in black. Classic kit. R red and white stripes. Hmm. That's not bad. At least they gave them a legendary kit. Ingolstadt. You see there. The red and black stripes. Alternate being blue. Classic kit. All Isaac. All Hans are great. Man, that's nice. It looks like a Miss America sash. Shelky. Um, gas prom, you know, the gas giant. Under fire nowadays because of the Russia invasion in Ukraine. The alternate, not that bad, blue and green. Black, oh, greenish um, thing. Classic Karcher, which is a pressure washer thing. Alright. Uh, Hamburg, uh, Fly Emirates, uh, two tone shirts now, the black, classic kit HSV, yeah, um, that looks pretty impressive to me. Hanover 96, alright, see the 96 up there. Their classic kit is just red and black with the 96 on it. Okay. Right. Herbert Berlin. Blue and white stripes. Buy at home. Hmm. Alright. The classic, not bad. White, black on it. Darmstadt. Alright, Don Strauss with the fleur de lis. Sometimes it's commonly placed in French culture. Classic kit. I don't know why they have Duke Jenna. I don't know why they have a classic kit. To be honest with you. Stugart. You see that? Mercedes Benz on it. Our sponsor is Stugart. Classic kit. Um, I don't know what the sponsor is. But yeah, you got that. Wolfsburg. The Volkswagen, green and white. Look, Volkswagen. Yeah, green and white Volkswagen with the X on it. Ugh. Classic kit. There's the Volkswagen logo with the with blue. Ugh. Oh, well. Burger Berman. See there. There's their classic kit, just the green shirt with the W on there. Not a bad idea. Okay, the Germany Sun International. I wonder how they do with the. Are they true to form or are they just. I think they're just 
paste it bland jerseys yeah it's just takes it home and away I know Canada's got a team in this that's when Canada was really bad it was a 66 attack two and a half stars anyway Italia okay um, all right we'll finish with Italy Atalanta well this video Atalanta Swiss game blue and green there Okay. Okay. Baloney. The stripes there. Carpe. Right there, right. Well, this is 2015. As a mutt. Okay. Carpe. Verona. My Verona. Dude. Oh, they have the horse. The guy and the horse at the bottom. That's down there. Nice. But not their road jerseys. Their home jerseys have that guy from the shield, but not this one. Hmm. Okay. Empoli. 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 Jensen. That's the way to go. I don't know if any of these guys have class kits. Or, okay. Florence. Maritina. All purple as they usually are. Okay. Oh, yeah, they have a classic kit. Maritina. Red and white. One half red, one half red, half white. There's one of them with the Fiorentina um, Fleur de Lis or close to it. I thought they would have had one with Nintendo. Frozen Known. Frozen Known. Calcio. Okay. Genoa. My Genoa. Okay, the red and black. Half these. See that? Alternate. Yeah, it's just the one color. Hellas Verona. Um, yellow and black. There you go. My Verona. Inter Milan. They should have some nice jerseys. Inter. Hosted by Pirelli Tires. F1 big tire maker at one time. Blue and black stripe. Is that driven? I think it says driven. Yeah. Driven. Classic kit. Oh, the red cross. That reminds me of England, though. Like, England. There's another classic kit. Um, white with the two-tone um, breast sleeve. Breast and sleeve. sleeve uh, stripes. Nick. Juventus. The Jeep. Love to be sponsored by Jeep. The black and white stripes and all that. Classic. And then the road jerseys are pink and all that. I remember seeing the pink jerseys and I'm like, we're not afraid to wear pink. Alternate. Okay. Classic kit. Okay. The blue with, looks like yellow stars and all that. That's right. Juventus used those jerseys in the 90s when they were in the Champions League final. Lazio. Next on the list. The, the famous sky blue for them. That's a weird, well, oh, that's an eagle. Okay, so that looks like an eagle in the center of that one for last wheel. Alternate. Mm -hmm. Okay. AC Milan. With the red cross that reminds me of, you know, who? That's England. I don't know why they have that shield on their home jerseys, but on the road jerseys, it's just their AC Milan thing with the star on the top. Now, a lot of people are like, what are those stars at the top? Are they for league titles? Well, no. Those stars represent how many times you win the Champions League, well, European Cup slash Champions League. Classic kit? Yeah, that would make sense. The red and black stripes. Oh, that looks like buttons at the front. Hmm. And then that thing. Milan. I don't know. That shield looks like the Italian flag, but hmm. I guess they were going back to the roots. Napoli. With the lette thing. Something in the middle. Kind of a shield. The bl the gray with the blue. Alternate red. Classic kit. Who's the sponsor? Uh, Bouff. Bouffant. I can't remember. I know Maradona made that shirt in Palermo. Wearing the pink at home. Straight set on the road. AC Roma, or AS Roma, I should say. 
Roma, classic red with the white shorts, white and red. Classic kit, Barella. One there. Okay, uh, Sampdoria. The famous blue with the stripes, plus on the stripes, and then the way jersey, the alternate yellow with a vertical stripe, classic kit. Um, that's that's been from the 30s and all that. Another classic kit, blue, uh, the two tone shirt for Sampdoria. Hmm. Sassuolo, green and black, Mate, Torino. They used to be big back in the day. There was the club in the 1940s, and then they had that plane crash into the side of the mountain in May of 49. And they were on their way to win five straight theirs. I think those shirts they were in the 40s. They were, they were on their way to their fifth Italian title in a row, and then they crashed it. But the good news is that all the opponents decided to put their youth teams in against uh, Torino's youth team. As a sporting gesture. Alright, so that's done. Korea, there's only one team I really like. Suwon. What about your Korea? It would be Mexico. Suwon. Gonna look at that. America. Huawei. Coca Cola. You know, they. I think they play at the Azteca. There's the Coca-Cola, the Club America thing. Coca-Cola. I don't know if I should investigate the Mexican jerseys further. She has Cruz Azul. Cruz Azul. The Blues. Full of blue. Yeah, yellow. Ooh, all right. Uh, Dorados, Guadalajara, Neon Monica, Monterey, Pachucha, Santos Laguna. Santos Laguna used to be a club, good club team too. Oh, I thought they wore the Corona jerseys, like like the beer Corona. Tigres, Tijuana, Union. Um, we're gonna just do a quick uh, Dutch. Well, the Dutch Ihawks, the famous red and white shirts, the red around the in the middle. They're wearing green on the road in these, this one. Mm. Uh, what? No, there's another one. PSV Eindhoven. There's PSV Philips. Makers of shavers and a crappy video game console. Is there alternate blue? Blech. I'm sorry, but I can't stand those jerseys. Norway, there's only one team that I like from Norway. Rosenberg. So Rosenberg, that's their jerseys. Polska. The greatest team there is Wiesla Krakow, I think. I think it was a crack. Is it a crack cow? Portugal, there's two big teams. Benfica and Porto. There's FC Porto. The blue and white stripes that are synonymous with them. And then you got the grit sand colored jerseys. Chocolate colored, I think. And the alternate being just plain white. Yeah. And the other team is Benfica. Well, there's sporting too. I should do sporting. Benfica, Fly Emirates, Arsenal, Leicester. Okay, and sporting. The famous green and white. The sporting, you know, the vertical stripe. The, no, horizontal. Horizontal. Sorry. Not that. The alternate green and white. Wow. Two tone. And that, and I think that was it, yeah. Ireland, well, Ireland doesn't really have any big teams. The rest of the world, is the Corrente, Minero, a lot of these are Brazilian teams. I don't know why they don't have the Chapo or Chape. Of course, 
I believe this was around the time that Chape actually crashed before they got to the um, Copa Libertadores final. Or was it the second tier? Was it the first tier or second tier championship? So yeah, so yeah, they were there for live. For a few, but yeah, a lot of the, I think it's Brazil. Although they should have, say, Brazil. Kaiser Chiefs of Lepiacos, or the Pirates, Palmeiras. Yeah, a lot of these guys from the rest of the world are from Brazil, but why don't they just, I guess, shock back them? I guess they don't have the right to the Brazilian league. Anyway, Russia. Who's the team that always seems to do well? Senate. To get to um, European club competition. Senate. Gazprom. <sighs> and Saudi Arabia. I don't think there was any good teams. Scotland. There's well, there's Aberdeen, that's the club of Sir Alex Ferguson. See there. There's Celtic, the famous Celtic jerseys. You see them green and white. Like a like a, I felt like the Celtic colors looked like Warrior Lockford stuff. Celtic away at home. Dundee, Dundee, there are two Dundee, Hearts, picture these are Hearts, those jerseys, Inverness, Kilmarnock, Motherwell, yeah, there's no, there's no Rangers in this one, I think they were just trying to fight out, okay, so Spain, I have to talk about Spain, next video, Sweden, the only good team, Malmo, Oh, they have a classic kit too. Hmm. I didn't know that. Oh, with a tie. The tie around the collar. Um, Switzerland. Basil? Well, it doesn't matter. Turkey. The big two. Basikas. And Santa Fresh. Basikas. Photophone. Alternate with the black. Okay, United States. So, women's 